What's going on YouTube? It's Flashback here. Um, today I'm going to be starting a new series. And ever since I got XSplit running properly, I've been trying to get a few new series up and running. That way we can actually do something with them instead of just relying on render time to decide basically what I'm actually going to upload. For this series I'm playing Sims 3 again, but instead of doing like a life series, I'm going to be building. Because I love building Sims 3, it's really the only reason I ever buy any of the Sims games. I freaking love building on them. They have EA has mastered, or Max, I'm sorry, has mastered the art of building in, in a video game with the Sims, and it's really what I feel I want to do with the Sims. So here it is, episode one. All right, and my earbuds are going on. All right. I need to fix something. In a moment, guys. Damn it. Alright, that. And then this needs to go to like negative three. We can bring this up to like seven, I suppose. Let's actually do this to the negative five. Alright, that should be helpful. Alright, let's see how that looks now. It's still a little dark. It is better, though. Oh, well. We'll figure it out as we go. So. What I am going to do... Is I'm going to actually edit town here. And I made this mistake last time. All right, and we need to select a lot. For my first episode, I don't want to build too large, so I'm going to kind of limit myself here. It's a 30 by 30, that's a 30 by 30 as well. Here are a 30 by 40. 30 by 40. I really should have picked out a lot before starting. What are you? You are 25 by 30? Yeah, I'm... I'm going to try and challenge my building skills here to basically uh, see what I can do. Okay, so this is the lot I'm working with here. Looking over the water. Huh, never noticed that. The water is stagnant. It doesn't have waves or anything. Could have done better, Maxis. Could have done better. Alright, so first things first. I need to get some walls laid. Now, on a lot like this, I want to save some space over here in the corner. Okay, you know what? First things first, I'm going to flatten the terrain. That's probably a better idea. So let's go ahead and flatten the lot. And I think that's about as good as it's going to get. Alright, so we need to go ahead and go to walls here. So I'm thinking I'm going to leave this side open. So let's go ahead and lay some foundation walls here. Actually, you know what? Let's undo that. Let's get a front wall here first. Garage can go on this side. I always have a hard time getting a good garage in because I, want, I always want a two-stall. All right, it's right there. I'm probably gonna have to move that over some yet. Well, let's go ahead and find out what I have to do here. No, that's actually gonna work out pretty well. All right, so just like so. And I'm gonna have this come up to about there, at which point it'll come across. To right about there, I'm gonna say. Right now we are leaving a lot of space over here, which I'm actually okay with because I don't want this to be a huge yard. Which is very rare for me. And actually I'm gonna undo all of this. And actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and bring this back to about here. And bring that across there. Alright. 
That's where I want the garage to be. It'll just look better. You know what? Let's move these over some. Just like so. Bring this one more out. We'll bring it back about that far. There. Out. Right there. Is that too much? Yeah, probably. We'll back that off about that far. Damn it. So I said I was going to leave that space back there open. However, I'm not so sure about that anymore. I'm thinking I might just leave this front space up here. But you know what? Screw it. I can do it anyway. You know what? It's actually not leaving me much space at all. Unfortunately, it's just something I'm going to have to live with. Oh, we'd go to about there. See if I go there, I can come across to that. Uh, no, we better just come straight in. That'll probably work. I'll have the kitchen over here. You can get out of here. Yeah, I'll have the kitchen over here. Put that down. Now, the first thing I need to do here is actually look into the cars, but parking spaces. Make sure there's actually enough space, which it looks like there is. Turn that over. They are in good placement. Okay. So now we continue back into the uh, wall building. Which, I'm actually just going to use... Yeah. Okay, so. I need to figure out where I want the entrance. I'm going to use a decent door for. It's probably a good one. Let's see if we can go for a darker. I don't know, I kind of like that. I'm thinking this can go right here. But I do want some things in particular here. So let's just test some things out over here in the kitchen. I can't put that there. I can only put the door on this side or there. I'm not necessarily opposed to it having it there. It might actually work out better for what I want. Let's come back down to this. I wanted that one. I'm thinking right about there. And then I have a nice little garden across here. Have a nice little garden along here, leading to another door going into the right there. Okay, so now we need a nice walkway. I don't know why I'm focusing so much on walkway right now, but I am. Alright, now let's actually find something decent. Alright, then here. All the way across, I suppose. Alright, bring the mailbox on over here. And the garbage right here. Okay, so I'll go ahead and have that there, why not? Alright. So now... Let's go ahead and get some walls up here, or some windows. Just give myself an idea what I want to do. Now I don't want a entertainment space on the main level here.
I will deal with the basement later, at a later point, not right now. So I want windows. Oh, shit. Didn't mean to do that. Now I'm not so sure about the Sir Cunningham on this one. I want a nice large window over there. But nothing that's going to overdo it. But you. I want something better than that. Nope. How would you look? You look pretty nice. I'm thinking I'm going to go with that, but I don't want gold. Nice white with black. Or not black, I guess. Eh, whatever. It works. can always mess with it later if I wish. Window of Opportunity versus the Wishing Window. I'm thinking the Window of Opportunity downstairs. Although I, again, want a nice long window down here. Well, down here I'm thinking just like that I'll have a window set up. Mark it out with a big ass window. Where that would have looked over there. Although I don't have to wonder because I don't I'm not putting it over there. I'm putting it over here. A couple of them, just like so. Alright. Now, I do want a main floor bedroom. With its own bath. So that'll be the bath. And the bedroom? Is that gonna be big enough? No, not really. You know what? Let's go ahead and keep all bedrooms off the first floor. Let's do a study over here instead. In which case, I probably could have left that all there. Bring this across here. Bring this over and this over again. Now, I do need an archway on this one. And I'm thinking something nice. I like that. It'll look real nice there. It's gonna be a nice little study, nothing overly spectacular. Alright, then over here... I'm going to need to place some counters and everything. I'm gonna go with the nice high-end counters. Of course, the cherry. Okay, so I'm thinking I actually want to bring the kitchen over here to this end. And what will this look like? It is a black. Just feel like it's a great place for a for a fridge. Couple islands here. I'm actually, going to remove this and place this one here. Ah, oh, shit! Undo. I said undo. All right. Now that does, however, mean I need to Copy this. Fortunately, it's not going to work out very well. Although it looks nice, I will give it that. All right. So if I put this one back here, just like so. Dang it. 
Gonna pull this one back and see what we can do about getting this form this way the proper way. Ah, shoot. No, no, it's okay. Kind of like it like this. However, if I'm going to do this, I'm going to pull this out here one more. Alright, and then I'm going to move all of these over. At which point, I'm going to go ahead and extend this back wall from this point over. And then eliminate it from here over. Which gives us a nice open space here. Probably doesn't even need to be really quite that big. I'll probably do that. Okay. This gives us a small little area back here, maybe for a porch. Okay, now. In order to make this work, do however have to extend it one more. And I wonder if I do this, will it work? It will. I may just have to pull this over. Bring this back one more. Okay, so if I had something just like that, you know what? No. I'll leave it like that. Just get rid of that one and just bring these over. Unfortunately, these don't want to form the proper way. Otherwise, what I could do is actually have these coming off here. Just like so. Unfortunately, I just don't really have the space for that. Well, it does look nice. Hmm. I'm kind of curious what this would actually look like. So if I keep it looking like that. I have all this usable space over here. I don't even necessarily need these. However, I do feel I want a half wall. At least along here. Kind of separating the kitchen from the rest of the house. Come on. It's formed properly here. Kind of give it a nice little nook design, but I. No, no. It's not worth it. I want to keep. Oh, well, that didn't look too bad right there. Gives us a space for our garbage over here. Uh, I'm just going to get rid of these. They're not worth the time or effort that it's that's required of it. So let's go ahead and just put these in like so. Now 
All right, and let's drop into here. Use the eyedropper again, which apparently still doesn't want to work. Bring us all the way across then. I don't think I want quite that design for it. I think I want to do something more along the lines of this. So if I go ahead and get out of that stupid mode, we have dishwashers. At which point I will actually drop the walls down because they're quite annoying right now. Put the dishwasher over here, the sink here, keep it out of the way. Something just like that. I like it. I like it a lot. Now I do need a stove, which I will be going with a high-end one because it's, I'm all about high-end class. I believe I want this here. At which point I can drop a nice microwave. Here. And yeah, that's just personal machine. I don't want red. Give me anything but red. I'll take gray. Right there. And just like that, we got stainless steel. And I will drop this here. So I'll drop this here. I just feel like it's a better fit. Eh, I'm going to have it there, I suppose. Now, one thing I do need to figure out here is where I want windows in here. realize this one here is backwards. Do I want them set up like that? Let's see here. It doesn't look too bad. However, I'm not sure how well the cabinets are going to work out. Alright, if I bring this across. Apparently that somehow fit on the managed to fit itself on the back. All right, I was afraid I was gonna have to get rid of that to fit more cabinets in through here. Yeah, I'm going to just turn this one here into a full wall. which point I will go ahead and come back into buy mode. Stick more plant or cabinets up here. What's going on over here? Why did that one form automatically and this one won't? Sure, now it will. There we go. Problem solved. How does that look with walls up? Doesn't look too bad. I'm thinking I'm going to go ahead and turn this into all wall here, though. And then drop a nice archway in here. I said archway. Okay, that one's a little too large, looks like. Is it though? I'm thinking yes. That, however, does need a half wall right there.
Let's do this one for here. Yeah, that, that, that looks stupid. <laughs> well, it's not a bad kitchen. It's not huge. I'm trying not to make it huge. Alright, we're going to go with a basic nice wood floor. I think we're going to go with an older, an old school look for the floor there. I did kind of want to direct access into the dining room from here, but it doesn't really matter too much to me. This is all going to be wide open anyway, and the position of the kitchen kind of makes it really awkward. Considering over here, I'm going to have a sitting area over here. At least that was the original plan. I'm thinking I'm going to keep the sitting area, but... Also thinking of adding a fireplace in there. What a decent looking fireplace though. It's just really modern, that one is. Thinking more in lines of this one. Pyro pit. Yeah, it looks nice. It's a nice little fireplace. So this here was going to be another, actually could put a dining room here instead. Which means I didn't really actually need any of this back here. Any of this extra space. Let's go ahead and get rid of it all and redesign this back here. Yeah. Doesn't look at all too bad. can just keep it like that. Keep it nice and flat back here. Just has a nice exit right there. The dining room up in here, which I think I'm going to go ahead and do. Which means I want carpeting through the rest of this for now. I will edit it as I come back to it. Make you that color carpeting for now. So I better make you that carpeting. And I'm not really sure what happened to that, or what caused it to end up like that, but for some reason it's brighter. Alright. So I'm thinking I'm going to want more of a tile around the fireplace. Just something like that. Just keep it safe. I just go right in, right next to it. Let's go something more edgy. Yeah, screw it. It'll be fine. It's carpet. Well, carpet fire never hurt anyone, right? Now, I want to get this done while I'm thinking about it. That is not the button I was looking for, was it? No. I want shrubs. I'm not sure that's the one I wanted. I think in Boxwood that's actually the one I wanted. Nope. Okay, too big. Just calm down here, dude. Dirt, dirt. We keep them trimmed around here. Even though it suddenly occurs to me I don't want any of these anyway. I want freaking flowers up here. None of this bullcrap. Now, do we have any decent flowers? We do, but they're large. These aren't bad, but they're pink. Those bushes won't be too bad. I'm gonna keep some rose bushes going here. Oh, vivid roses, semi roses, or rosy roses. Not vivid. Not pink. Oh, no, I want a bush. That's a given, and it looks like those are the only two that are bushes there. Yeah, stick some marigolds in here, why not? Because I don't want them, that's why. What we have over here, we have Azelius. Those are large. 
Those are also large. Lazy dailies. Those are so small. Marigold. Too small. I want something of some size. Yeah, whatever, that works. Now I do need a nice little fence for that. Nothing too big, just something nice and small. I'll go with a nice brick. Nice brick finish on it. Yeah, that looks nice. Bring this across just like so. Keep this coming down here. That was the wrong one, obviously. all the way down here. Keep it coming across, down, across, and down. Hopefully this looks decent. I really don't know if it will or not. But it appears to. Does that look good? Mm, that corner is really flimsy. See what looks what it looks like if I do something different, maybe like that. I need to scale it way down here. I don't want that roof pattern anyway. I want something more in the lines of this. Yeah. It's not bad. It's not the greatest, but it's not bad. Oh yeah, that's sexy. Sexy man. Interesting. Just think about going with that or that. I'm thinking this. Yeah. Scale it down a little bit. Of course, I'm going to go up another floor anyway, so it doesn't really matter that much. Alright, so I think this is going to be the end of episode one after I add some paint here, of course. Gotta have paint before I leave. If I can find it, it's there, of course. Now I want rock and stone, I think. It's a nice, a nice castle look. That'll actually look really nice. Once I add like a second story onto it and such. What is going on here? Okay, let's go ahead and go all the way back down here. Alright, so let's go up and up. There we go. That is the house so far. Alright. So that's it. My video is really interesting right now anyway. Focus. Okay. So thanks for watching, and I will leave you with the picture of the home. And we'll see you next time. Till then, take it easy.